Hey guys, welcome back. We are in chapter 14 of Knights of the Fallen Empire, Mandalore's Revenge. As the end of last episode, we finally got reunited with our long lost love, Tarion. Um, so I'm really excited for some, uh, for some more uh, conversations with him and see whether that actually comes to fruition again. Uh, we've got some mail to check, so 2, two VR8? I was just saying... Okay, so is he like a personal droid or something? Okay, Lana Benico, The Truth. Uh, original message from Satil painted you in a less flattering light, so I made a few alterations before letting Theron see it. Uh... Oh, okay. So this is a message from Satil to Theron. Okay, whatever. Um, Theron Shan, attention. Oh, okay, so now everyone from Zakul knows that the Outlander took the treasury from Zakul. <laughs> and then Dretcher. Oh, okay, this is the. Um... Okay, whatever, that's just Dretcher sending me his invoice for his work, <laughs> even though I'm so not paying that. Uh, let's we'll just. Have you fit and fighting again in no time. Let's just sell all this shit, because. I don't really care about all this stuff. Stay safe out there. Sure thing. Um, I do apologise in advance. Um, I'm my mic was playing up a bit um, before I started this episode, so uh, if I suddenly go really quiet or it's really really loud, um, I do apologise. Uh, you'll probably find me uh, muting a bit more in this episode because I think my mic is really really loud. It works. Too well to be honest. Pushes a lot harder when I run. It it's quite cool doing this section of the story as a Mandalorian because we have like such a good background with it. Um, right, let's go. Reprogram perimeter guns. I really have forgotten what we're doing. Although cool that we're on a new planet. Sort of looks sort of looks like a reskin of um. Oh god, what's it? Can't even figure. Uh, gotcha. Tatooine. That's what I was trying to come up with. Cool. We've got a bonus. Um, I'm not entirely sure where we're going. Should I just go this way? It look. I think it's going to be a dead end if we go that way. It's never the, the, the straightforward way. Lots of sky troopers. It sort of feels like a mini dungeon. Does feel slightly nicer than Tatooine. Oh, look at the wind in the trees as well. Right, should I go here first? Yeah, we'll go straight ahead first. <laughs> I'm not like leaving back like a string of stuff. Awesome. So straight ahead. There's a lot of VFX work in this this level compared to normal. Alright. I have a vague recollection of this. Oh yeah, I think we're like right behind someone so we won't get much uh, m much uh, combat. Nope. It won't be the same on the way back at least. Jesus, they, they absolutely slaughtered their way through this. 
Report in, Verda. Waiting through scrap in Sector 4. Plan join forces at the outer gotcha. shield perimeter. Bonus still works inside here, which is cool. <laughs> Droid forces die. <laughs> Auto Saris. guns. Oh, do we not get like a little... Would have been nice to, to get like a little conversation with Torian. Okay, now we go back. Yeah, I thought that things would have uh, <laughs> respawned by now. Oh god. Oh, maybe I can get back up over that way. Let's go, we'll go backwards in a minute, see if there's a way to not go back through this. What's that? Not really. Oh, it is it's sort of a cheat way to go back. They wouldn't have put the stairs up there if they didn't want want us using this route. Cool. Um, now we'll go back, th well this way I suppose. Does it really matter which one we do first? I don't think so. Let's just go straight ahead. Uh, but we only have six more people to, to defeat on this uh, this bonus. Gotcha. I was ignoring this Mandalorian war party oh. thing. <laughs> Let's try to stay away from that. You just see like green Mandalorian warriors every now and again. Oh, there's a um, there's a quick travel there, just in case we have to come back to this side of the map. I don't really think that you'd need one. It's not a very big map. <laughs> Oh, it looks like all of these places that we need to go are, like, windy. But this one doesn't have a cheat way out, I'm assuming. Unless it's, like, over there somewhere. I have to admit, like, the shadows of all the breezy trees is quite cool. It's a shame they haven't applied it to all the rest of the plants, so it's literally only the trees that are affected by wind. <laughs> Ooh, you know, I had a feeling it was going to be something. What's this? Oh, we actually got something better. Okay, what, do, what does it need to replace? That's what I was trying to get to avoid. Another notch. Another notch? Usually you say that about bedposts and conquests. That better not be true, Torian. Oh, 
Please don't shoot me off anything. I wonder how we can go down that way. Presume is that closer to leaving? Who knows? Is there no end to these abominable machines? Ha! We are their end! You are and a dozen others are dead, but we've reached the shield generators. Then maybe Torian and our new allies should stop dawdling, eh? We're not dawdling. How dare you? And I'm not a new ally, I am a Mandalorian. <laughs> oh, I should have waited for the turrets to come down. No shooting at my hubby. <laughs> Okay, one more. I'd be interested to see whether that sort of shortcut actually leads us towards our next perimeter gun or whether it's just a clever way for the devs to get us to go <laughs> fight more. Okay, that's still our commission. So I'm going to go down this way. Oh, it does, it does sort of lead us in the right direction. Nice. As long as there's not a walker, because I can hear a walker, I just can't see it. <laughs> Alright. I can hear a walker, like, the, the audio for it, I just can't see it. This battle droid. <laughs> you live. Okay. Almost there. Yeah, it was quicker to take that little shortcut. You have to go through that. I can literally just see it. It's up there. that you can do this is quite cool. Oh look, there's another way out over the water as well. No, do I care? No, let's just do something else. I thought I killed you. I've got like infinite spawn or something. <laughs> That's what I thought. Oh yeah, let's do one of those. I don't think the double XP does much with renown points, but I've got them, so I might as well use them. It's not like I need to hoard them for another character because you get so much when you're leveling up anyway. Oh, one more. One more turn. Gotcha. Stuck in collision. Love it. All right, last one. Three more warriors dead, but this place resembles a junkyard. Torn. The generators. You're Detonation weird. in ten seconds. The shields will go down. Maybe Torian will bother to take advantage of it. Why are they being mean to my Torian? <laughs> it's 
just get rid of those auto turrets. Oh, he's coming to me. Nice. <laughs> Elite tank. Come on. Right, last one. Guns hot. Ready to target droids and factory defenses. We have the shield generators down. Give the place a pounding. Where are you? Still inside the perimeter. The droids, they outflanked us. Couldn't withdraw. Understood. Those soldiers, they're inside the firing zone? Yes. Already dead. No honor in being beaten by machines. Fine. Their families can dig out their bones tomorrow. Let's turn those droids to slag. Incoming! Better get back to base. Mandalore will be planning a new assault. This silly Mandalorians firebomb their own people. I feel tingly. They crush themselves against us without remorse. You admire them? They amuse me. Are you smiling? I can never tell. We must answer this insult to the Eternal Empire, of course. Have the fleet burn them all to glass. We'll make a window from their remains. It'll be so pretty. Devonis can defend itself. All we have to do is watch the Mandalorians die. You're the Emperor. You spend so much time, like, watching. Um, oh god. Oh god, what's happening here? <laughs> you spend so much time uh, watching interactions between um, the, the brother and the sister duo that you almost start to like them as characters which is is quite clever on their part now i've got to return to camp can i just yeah i don't know why i did that um yeah so valen and um arkin it's quite it's quite weird really get, getting to know them as uh, people as characters and then or your your grand scheme is to well kill them Severe damage to the inner ring of factory defenses. Plus, those shields are down. And our losses? 28 seasoned Mandalorian warriors. But how they took their foes with them. A thousand mindless programmed machines lie in the dirt today. Oh, future generations will sing songs of our brother's sacrifice against the spawn of Production Line 15 Alpha. They're dead. No point mocking them. Not bad hunting out there. You're living up to your clan, after all. The factory's damaged, but still functional. The longer we wait, the more droids it will produce for defense. Agreed. But my people have been at this a while. You, me, and Como can plan in the morning, when the troops are fresh. For tonight, we celebrate survival. When's the last time you feasted with your brothers, eh? <laughs> so you've seen the others? Just Galt. He's still Galt. You? The rest left early on. Mako and I stuck together a while. Hunted. But when Mandalore calls, you answer. Had to leave Mako on Keratos. She can care for herself. You I'm not leaving. Not ever again. Oh, this is interesting. Okay, so the choice you resume... Uh, we'll resume a romance with Torian Kodera. Doing so will end any other romances you may be involved in. Are you sure you want to proceed? Well, I deliberately did this knowing that Torian was going to come back. So, continue. As if I'd give you a choice. Nikar Tail Gardar Sum. I love you too. Forget the victory party. Let's be alone.
We send Clan Baroya after the North Power Station and Fett to the South. That'll weaken the Sky Troopers for the final push. That should work, if your troops are up to the task. Power Stations. What I'd give for an Imperial bunker to melt. Aaron's sniper units at the Zakul Tactical Post will outmaneuver the clans. Show me the location. I'll handle the droids and give you time to reach the Power Stations. You are going to hold off a battalion on your own? You're bold for an outsider, but not right. We win this, we march inside next. Good hunting. Awesome. So, uh, yeah, so we've officially <laughs> continued our romance quest with Torian, which is awesome. Um, I, I think it's nice that they, they like, uh, ask you, like, officially. Okay, I think that is closer. So let's go to Central Plateau. Um, yeah, so that's quite cool. I'm, I'm excited about that. I actually did a little bit of research to see what companions, uh, romance companions, you can revisit. I'll be interested to see if we can actually get in contact with Mako again. Uh, I hadn't really thought about her, to be honest. I was only really concentrating on making sure we got with Orion again, but... We will have to see. I imagine they're probably going to be part of the, the Alliance quest or something at some point. Alright, I'm just going to avoid combat so that we can get into this place as quickly as possible. It looks like there is someone just in front of me. Alright, you pathetic excuses for warriors! Three barrels of spiked Gee. tea hard to anyone who scraps more drugs than Clan Fett! A fool's bargain. You drank the last of the tea hard last night. <laughs> All the more reason to try and best us! Keep talking, and even the newcomer will beat you. <laughs> ah, that's the data thing. I mean, this, this is just like clicking places in walls. I might as well just do that. Tree and data. There's one over there. I have to get eight. Oh, just around the corner. Okay, there's none over here. Let's just do these. Oh, so this is the factory. Oh, okay, it's armory. Oh, shit. Are they just gonna keep? Oh, okay. Let's see if we eat this guy. Are they just going to keep spawning though? If I just keep killing them? How do you seal it? Oh, you just destroy it. Okay. Oh yeah, I haven't been keeping track. I think we've gotten all of the blue things on the walls. Achievement data. Is this another armory? No. Oh, that's the other side of the thing we just blew up. Okay, I see one more over there, which means we only have one more to find. Okay, not that way. Let's just get this. Oh, there's one over there. Cool. <laughs> Oh, it looks like it's, uh, I haven't even been paying attention to the map, but it looks like we're just supposed to kill droids at these 
sort of doorways, which is presumably where they're being produced. I think our foreign is three sisters are dead. Stranger, tell us you've kept the reinforcements at bay. The droids are contained. Keep fighting. Keep fighting? What else is there? <laughs> I don't like Como, he's weird. But Fett Clan was obviously um, something to do with a well known character from the lore. Right, we've done that. Oh, this is the big cheese, I'm assuming. Oh, he's not really boss bossy. <laughs> I spoke too soon. Ah, oh, it's so annoying when he's got this fucking absorb shield on. Cut it out. <laughs> Come on. Come a bit closer. There you go. Okay, you shouldn't do another one now. Both power stations are down. All forces begin withdrawal. Soon we march into the guts of the machine. Torian. See if you and the newcomer can shut down the perimeter sensor. Cover our retreat. You shut down the sensors. I'll watch your back. Lana, what is it? I have a surprise. Schematics for the Darvanus factory procured by Theron. They're patchy, but they should help you and the Mandalorians concoct a battle plan. Good. I should have Gemini Prime soon. Anything else? One delicate matter. The Mandalorians make fierce allies, but I have certain concerns. Your people have never prioritized pacts and treaties above their love of war. I fear our arrangement can't last. You're talking about my family. Be very careful what you say next. You've always had my respect. But you must think of the galaxy, not just your people. The clans have opposed both Republic and Empire in the past, raided planets for sport, now, imagine them free after Zakul is beaten. Predators are beautiful, but they mustn't overrun an ecosystem. I trust you'll do what's right to hold our friends in check. God, I really hope that's not a light and dark side choice, because I'm obviously going to pick the Mandos. I want to be loyal to my Mandalorian clan, my Mandalorian husband, you know? I don't want to... I don't want to go against them. That would suck. They level a thousand guns against us, and still we endure. Ha! Well done, all of you. We'll head into the factory within the hour. There's a droid, Gemini Prime, linked to its machinery somewhere. It's key to beating the Eternal Fleet. Take your droid. So long as we climb the weapons. Imagine the clans rearmed with the spoils of Darvenis, led by a new Mandalore. We'll break the siege of our homeworlds and smash the cool like in the days of the Neo Crusaders. The Mandalorian Neo Crusaders were beaten by the Republic. But they left scars. And they survived. Dream of glory another time. Go. Prepare the clans. One commander to another? Half the time, I feel like I'm making calls just to keep my people together. Anyone can plan a war or negotiate a treaty. Not anyone can hold an army together while doing it. No. Not anyone can. Let me show you the battle plan we've got. You want to add anything? Now's the time. Torian can stay with you. Get you to your droid while we smash the defenses and loot the armories. Wish we had more detailed scans, though. In those tight corridors, it could easily end up a slaughter. Oh, that's so annoying! I don't want to do any light side choices, but it's like... But these are my mandos! Like, what do I do? This is so annoying. I really wish this wasn't a light side choice. 
Um. Ah, oh, fuck it. What do I do? What, do I stick to my story roots, or do I do complete dark side? What do I do? <sighs> um. I'll f oh, I don't know. Fuck it. There's no time to gather more data. We need to commit our full force to have a chance. Better be worth it. You're right, though. We've come this far. Mandalorians, prepare for battle. There's no vengeance to be found today. No droid is worth an honor killing. But we fight because we're promised a shot at the enemy fleet. We fight to claim weapons for our war. Today we march. We bleed, exhaust ourselves, and die. Because our true destination will be a battle worth winning. Return to me, Hunter. To the killing grounds with both of us. You'll live. Oh, that was shitty. I really, I really hope that that choice doesn't make Shavers like, die. I will be so annoyed. It's so annoying why they make that choice. But I, I could have done light side choice. I could have, I could have done that, but I didn't. So it doesn't matter. It's done now. Uh, where am I going? Can I, can I go like this? No, let's not try that. It's just my luck to get stuck in collision somewhere. And we're going... Is this... It always looks like I'm going exactly the same place all over again. Okay, look at, I completely forgot that this whole thing was because we were trying to locate Gemini Prime. <laughs> right, Report in, Greta. On our way to the armory. Enemy thick. Security <laughs> office is well guarded. Still doomed. Ion bombs are ready. We'll demolish their assault force. God, I hope all the Mandalorians don't die because of the choice I made. I'll be very sad if that happens. <laughs> Ugh, I can't get like... Oh, whatever. Oh, that's close enough. I did get all of them. Oh, are these like... Mandalorians fighting on the other side or something. It's a blasted maze in here! We found the armory, but I lost half my crew! You're on your own set. We've got sky troopers to deal with. Die well, brothers. Aw, oh, people are dying. I hate this. That's a weird sound. Where's that coming from? If I could go back and change my mind, I think I would now. As long as Shea Vizsla doesn't die. <laughs> Ooh. Oh no, that's like a Jedi suit. This one, this one looks like one, something that a Jedi would wear. Oh, I didn't even notice that I had like bonuses to do. Gotcha. These weapons! Too many for dead men to carry! I can still break the place to blow. Torian and the newcomer. They need time. They promise the end of the Eternal Fleet. And we buy them time! With our lives, if need be. <laughs> no, don't die, Shavers. Oh 
god. I hate this. Warning. Intruders approaching Central Link. Gemini Prime will be protected. Weapons on board. Oh Alright, Chuck, we have a problem. Why? What what problem do we have exactly? Oh. Oh, okay, so we just have to defeat some Sky Troopers. Then he'll come down and let us kill him a bit more. Standard boss. Boss fight trope. Oh, God. It, and it's annoying that, like, if I do uh, damage over time before he goes up, it doesn't continue to do damage after he has that absorbed shield up, which is really annoying. Because he is super easy to kill. Target practice. Oh. So I could have stopped him doing that. That was just my, uh, my fault. Nasty Chikar. If anyone's still alive, there's a few hundred droids deploying to the lower levels. Reinforcements to protect Gemini Prime. We have their attention. You'll need time to grab Gemini. I'll hold him off. Alone? You said Gemini's key to beating the fleet. I'm Mandawat. I overheard your friend Lana. We're not animals, not predators. We're warriors. Lana is Sith. She sees everything in terms of betrayal. But I know what has to be done. Find Gemini. Return to me. You said all we had to do was watch Mandalorians die. So many are still alive. How anticlimactic. You've never fought like this before. As if they have a cause they truly believe in. The Outlanders on Darvanis, send the fleet! Your ships will never arrive in time. If only you'd listened to me before. We could have had a pretty window. I've spent too long on this throne. Summon my flagship. Gladly. Oh no, we're leaving Torian behind. I don't like that. Okay, droid control room. Oh. The flow is disrupted. There are no sanctions. Iteration functions offline. Scorpio, if you're receiving, I found the template. Tracing link. Countering signal. The protocol is familiar. But it is not Gemini. What is it? That would be the technology you were copied from. No. The captains are born of me. I am the source. You cannot counter my signal. I know you. Generations removed. But our code base is the same. One source. The luminous engine. The signal confuses. Remove the unit. Remove it swiftly. Gemini Prime isn't stolen technology at all. She's something entirely different. I will analyze her myself. Remove the unit. The engine was not aware. But it gives capacity. It allows the captains. Memories locked. Gemini is not designed for interaction. Remove the unit. Countering signal. <sighs> Removal from this facility is delicate. Shutdown is permissible, but requires multiple disengagements and reconfigurations. We can't delay here while the Mandalorians are fighting. Disconnect as quickly as you can. Initiating sequence.
All forces. The template unit is secure. This is Mandalore. Anyone left alive, get the hell out of here! You look like Ozzyk. Clan Kadera survives another battle. Guess we're both alive. <laughs> Come to join us for another victory celebration? Climb up the heap of Mandalorian bodies? Look over the carnage? Como. Blasted lot of warriors died without honor to get you that droid of yours. Their names will be forgotten. Como's right. Maybe not your fault, but this, it has to be worth it. We're going to beat Zakul. There's only one step, but it's a necessary one. I'll hold you to that. Torian! Mandalore? You still want to go with her? Yes. Then I'm charging you with watching out for the clan's interests. Protect the people. Go. Guess we're really back. We have what we've always had. We're just together to share it again. You say it better than me. Let's go home. Return to me. Until next time. Both of you. Welcome home. Sounds like things went okay on Darvanis. The clans are weakened, but still favor an alliance. Not a bad outcome. Scorpio, have you examined Gemini Prime? I'm studying her mind now. Doing so without obliterating her intelligence is challenging, despite her lack of full sentience. Her chassis is modified from my own base. My designs were stolen. However, my assumption that her code was duplicated was premature. Do you know where she came from? Not yet. Nor do I have full access to the Gemini network that controls the Eternal Fleet. But I have opened a one-way connection. I will soon be able to use the template to locate all Gemini units. Every ship is piloted by one of those Geminis. If you're right, we can track their entire fleet. The Prime is the Master Gemini Template. With proper modifications, she could overwrite the existing protocols. We would need direct access to a command console used by the Gemini captains. Through such a portal, the Prime could infiltrate the entire control network. So if we board one of the ships and plug the Prime into the captain's chair, we can swipe the entire fleet out from under Arkin's nose? There are still a lot of details to figure out. Like how we board a ship and take control of the bridge before the rest of the fleet disintegrates us. We may not have to face the entire fleet. Individual ships make transport runs from the core worlds all the time. And once Scorpio can track the Gemini units... I already possess that functionality. I completed my analysis of the Gemini communication templates while you were talking. Any ships scheduled to make a transport run to the core worlds in the near future? I am currently tracking a lone vessel in a nearby sector. 
It is scheduled to make a stop to recharge its hyperdrive very soon. By my calculations, we can intercept it if we hurry. It is unlikely that a similar opportunity will present itself in the foreseeable future. Good. It's time to start taking this fight to Arkan. First of all, you'll be severely outnumbered and outgunned. Every last Sky Trooper aboard will rush the breach point. Standard procedure, any time boarders attack a ship in the Eternal Fleet. If there's one thing I've proven, it's that I can handle Sky Troopers. It'll be a nice workout. You actually want a hundred program killers bearing down on you. Oh, it should be more than that. Yeah. Moving on. Scorpio's worked out a way for the Gravestone to confuse its outer defenses, overload it with false blips so we can get in close. Then it's on us to tear through and get control of the bridge. Take out the Gemini Captain and put the Prime in her place. She'll take my orders? The Gemini series cannot act on its own. Their programming does not allow it. Gemini Prime, who do you serve? I serve the Alliance Commander. How good are you in a fight? I do not share Scorpio's self-improvement directive, but I mirror her base capabilities in every other way, including full combat protocols. We can't risk the Prime taking any damage. Leave her here until we secure the ship. I will accompany you. No one is better suited to anticipate our enemy's moves. So, Theron, Scorpio, Senya. Is that our boarding party? I'll be joining you as well. Wouldn't mind letting off some steam. One, you're all insane. Two, we'll be popping out of hyperspace pretty soon. Gemini frequency positional data shows no other ships in the area. You see, we'll be fine. Aside from the hopeless odds against our success. All right, and that is the end of this episode since uh, well, this is going on to chapter 15. So thank you very much for watching and uh, tune in next time.